Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is actually going to be really exciting and something that I've actually never done before. It's going to be a lookbook, but Enneagram inspired. I'm sure that's why you probably clicked on this video, um, just because it's fun. Um, I know Katie, you, I hope I'm pronouncing that right. So sorry if I'm not. She did a what the college majors would wear and that's kind of what inspired me. So I've been wanting to film this video for a couple months now, but I was in my dorm. But now that I'm at home, have more of my clothes, I thought I would finally film this video. This video also is actually going to be split up into three parts since there is nine Enneagram numbers. I just wanted to evenly split it apart. So today is going to be one through three. I also just want to say I got all of my inspiration from Pinterest and um, I made a board for each of the Enneagram numbers so I'm super super excited. It's all I really have to say so let's go ahead and jump into the video. Starting off strong, we're going to talk about type 1. So I'm actually a type 1 and we are known to be perfectionist and so as you guys can see that definitely correlates into the style so as you guys can tell there's going to be a lot of neutral colors in here i mean of course there is going to be the occasional pop color but um yeah while i was researching i found a lot of monochrome outfits were a thing there were turtlenecks there was always a handbag and you know that handbag had a planner in it um so each piece has a purpose for number one and i couldn't say um, anything else because that is spot on. Um, I, I found a lot about loafers or sandals, some cute earrings, always organized. Um, and yeah, some of these pieces are from the loft. We have some from Ralph Lauren, but yeah, this is Enneagram number one. Some quick little facts. Enneagram ones typically are workaholics, afraid of making mistakes, and they're goal oriented. <laughs> Moving on, we have the most self-proclaimed Enneagram number, which is number two. I know a lot of twos. We don't know if they're actually twos or not, but um, anyways. So what I am reminded of when I see Enneagram two fashion is kind of like Christian girl. You have long cardigans, very open sandals, graphic tees, um, hats for sure. Hats are a must. Um, some stuff that I found while looking um, is they usually have comfy shoes, um, like I said, graphic tees are really nice, and um, long cardigans. That's basically a number two for you. They also, um, on one of my little pages, said they tend to be a group fitness ready, so you know, if you're a number two, I, I guess you're group fitness ready. Quick facts, um, number twos usually are great listeners, expect to be appreciated, and their emotions are over the top. Also, they're called the helper. The last one for today is actually going to be number three, the achiever. Everything I researched had a lot to do with blazers and underneath those blazers was usually a normal outfit like this could be spiced up. And um, as you guys can tell by the title, the achiever, you know, they want to look nice. Other things that it said were a lot of puffy sleeves, um, leather pants. I didn't have any leather pants, but I decided to spice an outfit up by adding some bright, bright colors. Some other things that um, Pinterest led me to is that type threes usually um, dress to impress. They want to be, quote, Instagram worthy. <laughs> um, also, booties are definitely, definitely a big three thing. And obviously, just if you're a three, you need to own a blazer. Although I'm not friends with any threes that I can think of, you can tell that they're definitely put together, although they still have a mix of casual and cute. Some little tips about threes are they are usually ambitious and driven. They love to be in the spotlight. They're competitive and they seek to have a successful life. If you're a three, you just know you're a boss. Okay guys, that's going to be the end of this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. For some reason, I didn't film the outro when I filmed the intro. Like I just got done 
cleaning my room from all of these clothing pieces but hopefully you enjoyed it um i actually was texting my roommates when i was in my two outfits and libby's actually two and chris was like that's how libby dresses you're definitely a two right now hopefully the other ones kind of matched with the enneagram numbers like i mentioned in the voiceover i am an enneagram one so um yeah, this is just my take on it and Pinterest take because all my inspiration is from Pinterest. But yeah, um, comment down below what Enneagram number you are. Um, if you're one through three, let me know how I did on the outfits and then let me know what you guys want to see. I'm currently filming Vlogmas. I'm just doing week in the life Vlogmas. So I think there will be five week long vlogs. But um, yeah, hopefully this is up on Thursday. I can't, I think that would be December 3rd. Hopefully I'm doing my math right. But um, yeah, that's it. I'm gonna go ahead and go. Yeah, have a wonderful day. Hopefully you guys are enjoying all your other YouTubers um, vlogmases. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and go. Peace and love. Bye guys. Hey, feeling good. Like I